Hello, I'm Kurt Campbell with Caravan Outfitters, and I am very excited to show you our latest creation, the Alpaca. Now, when we engineered this multi-purpose van, we wanted to use a Mercedes 144, their shorter wheelbase, so it could be an everyday driver. This van seats five people, has two beds, one a queen, one a full size, and it also has plenty of space so you could use it as a cargo van during the week. Without further ado, let's go inside. All right, let's begin. So the first thing I want to talk to you about is our relationship with Van Equipped, a European company that makes floors and seats and some other components. But all of our alpacas have their floors and seats. Now the floors are insulated. Ours have five L tracks that allow the seat to be put in and then glide back and forth. I have to tell you the most important feature besides just the amazing quality of these two products. They are above and beyond the most safety approved seats and floors in the industry. So if you care about your passengers, this is what you want. I'm sitting on a three person bench seat. The quality is amazing. It has two car seat safety anchors. And best of all, this bench seat turns into a bed. Probably the most important element of a good camper van is the bed. And we were able to fit two beds into this 144 Mercedes-Benz Sprinter. Now I'm going to show you what it looks like and how it works. So here, the three passenger seat turned into a full-size bed. Only my legs are underneath the other bed which gives me the ability to sit up straight and enjoy the freedom of all this space. Now let's talk about the queen bed. This is a true queen size bed, 60 inches wide, 80 inches long, not one of those short beds that a lot of the other builders put that go side to side. And so you don't have to step on your friends downstairs. We put this handy little step here to help you get right into bed. And as you can see, I can sit straight up. All of our alpacas come with front swivel seats, which really helps us utilize this table that we have here for food or game nights. Let me show you now the uh, purpose of our taco bed and how to store this table. Simply lift up, lock into place, Fold the leg up, lift up, put the table in its catches, and there you have it. In a camper van, storage is always a premium and you can't have too much of it. So one of the great designs of this taco bed was allowing us to have all this cavernous storage down here for all of your bedding and any other items you may want to get from the front of the van. You may have various reasons for wanting to move your bench seat. I'm going to show you just how easy it is. Lift up this bar, pull it forward to gain more cargo access, or bring it all the way back here if you want more leg room. Push the bar down to lock it into place. The Alpaca has some very interesting cabinet designs. One is this drawer right here, which houses a single burner induction cooktop. Now this cooktop can be placed anywhere you want, but there is a outlet right above, and there's another one right out here, which works perfect for our outdoor table design. You also have storage located right here and storage underneath the table. Great for spices or cookware. You have a bottle opener, you have a very large drawer and you have a 50 quart fridge with a freezer. More cabinets and more storage. These are our two uppers. Both are hinged. Great for accessing all sorts of items. 
Here we have an upper storage shelf. Uh, we use this currently for all the curtains that go around the van so that you can have absolute privacy. Tucked away above the sliding door is our control panel. Here we have the light switch with a dimmer. We have the refrigerator on and off. We have the Fiamma extend and retract button for the awning. We have the S-Bar heater. We have the battery monitor. We have a 110 volt outlet and we've got the inverter monitor. We also have the optional Bluetooth holder and as you can see, mosquito netting for the side door as well as the rear. Each of our vans also includes two reading lights for the upper bed. Simply push on the button and get it to the position you want. They also incorporate USB ports down below. Speaking of USB ports, we have two over here. One's a USB-C and one's a standard USB. And then underneath the passenger window, up front, we also have the same outlet. All alpacas come equipped with a Max Air fan system. This particular alpaca also has an AC unit. Now this AC unit runs on shore power or for short periods can run on your auxiliary battery. Let's look at this garage. Oh my goodness, this thing's huge. Look at that cavernous space. And the bed up above is fully removable so you could take tall objects like motorcycles in this van. Over here we have netting. The top nets can be accessed from the upper bed. We have this huge storage compartment over here in the cabinet that can be accessed from the garage or when it's in bed mode from the people that are sleeping down below. Great place for clothes and things such as that. Here you'll see we have a light that totally illuminates this garage space. We have a 12 volt adapter, another two 110 volt outlets. If you look back there, that's where our creative engineers stow our whole battery system. The lower part of this cabinet holds a 24 gallon fresh water tank. To access that water, simply pull out this hose, push in this connection, turn on the pump switch, which will tell you how much water you actually have in the system, and you're ready to go. You probably noticed the porta potty. Believe it or not, you can use it right here. And I'm gonna show you why. Once again, the taco bed comes in handy. Simply lock it into place. You got yourself privacy when you shut the door and you got your own space, but it gets better than that. Feel free to brush your teeth while you're at it because right here, you have a sink. We've installed four windows in each of our alpacas. Two of them are in the back, they're bunk windows with screens and slides. And then these two large windows up front in the passenger compartment, they also have screens. Now this provides amazing ventilation, especially in the warm summer evenings when you're trying to sleep. On top of that, this van is completely insulated. So it truly is a four season vehicle. Sometimes it's the attention to the little things that really make a van stand out. And I want to give an attaboy to our engineering team who came up with these bunk window shades. Total blackout privacy. They fold into place. You can then slide the bunk window, get ventilation. You can take the whole thing out if you want to, to get both sides of the window. Caravan Outfitter orders all of our Sprinter vans very well equipped. In fact, upwards of $23,000 in accessories to be exact. They come in two wheel drive, and all-wheel drive. And they include such wonderful features as two front swivel seats that are heated, adaptive cruise control, parking 360, 10 inch screen, digital rear view camera, and many, many other features. Let's take a minute and talk about some of the exterior features of the Alpaca. We have a Fiamma 45S power awning. We have side steps right here on all our all-wheel drive models. We have a lockable fresh water fill. We have gray water discharge. We have a 5,000 pound capacity tow hitch standard on all of our vans. Here we have an optional ladder that goes to our standard roof rack. That's on all of our vehicles. It has the optional solar panel 
And here we have the shore power hookup. And last but not least, we have the optional light bar up front. One of our cool options is this shower curtain system. Of course, you need a shower with it, and we've got that handled too. But for the purposes of this, I just wanted to show you our enclosure. To get out, simply undo the magnets and put it away. I want to also thank you for watching this video. It was fun making it, and I hope you enjoy our alpaca.